I think a lot about 2014 when we all witnessed Eric Garner, Michael Brown, 12-year-old Tamir Rice, among many others who were killed by cops. But why wasn't that enough in 2014 for the country, you think? You know, and you mentioned Tamir Rice's name. I just saw <clears throat> my 12-year-old was running around the house with a cap gun, a black cap gun. And I thought about Tamir Rice and I, you know, You let your son still play with toys like that? Actually, no. <laughs> my son um, went into my Amazon account and he ordered it. And I didn't know he had ordered it. And, um, you know, the talk again about can't, can't play with cap guns. Children get killed for that. I'm so sorry that you had to have that conversation with your 12 year old. You know, and the same way I, I saw my son with it. I don't know, did Tamir's mother know that perhaps he had ordered a cap gun on Amazon and was outside playing with it? So to answer your question, um, I think the difference now, I, I surmise is, and I've said this a lot during COVID, our communities are sick and they're tired and we're dying. And we have, at least with the Obama-Biden administration, we had hope. With this president, where so many of our communities are hopeless right now. And he, he does nothing but divide us. <laughs> <laughs>